What's up people of the internet? I'm the Pigboat here with yet another video. In this video we'll be testing the Intel Celeron N2840 which is a CPU based on the silver mode architecture and part of the Bechera family of power efficient processors. It has 2 cores and 2 threads and it has a frequency of up to 2.58 GHz. The Celeron N2840 has the Intel HD graphics page rail as the integrated graphics, which have 4 unified shaders and a frequency of up to 700 in H2 MHz in the N2840's case. It's also based on the Intel HD 4000's architecture or using the latest Java suite available. You also have 4GB of RAM in single channel mode, as well as a 500GB hard drive for the operating system and 1TB external one on which the ROMs and emulator are installed. As for operating system, we're using Windows X Lite Optimum 10 Pro version 2. You can find the full description of the specs in the video description down below. Today, we'll be benchmarking free GameCube and free Wii games using the Dolphin emulator. By the way, shout out to the people who requested me to try this out. I'm using version 3.032 bit of Dolphin. Let me show you the settings that I'm using for the emulator. There you go, we're first gonna test the GameCube games and after that we will test the Wii ones. So let's get straight to the points now.
And now let's test the Wii games. An important note, since it's impossible to convert RVZ files to ISO ones in Dolphin 3.0, you do have to download a new version of the emulator to do so, and since someone will eventually ask, you can convert RVZ files to ISO game ones by placing the RVZ file in a folder, then opening the new version of Dolphin. Now go to Options, Configuration, Paths, press the Add button, then navigate to the folder where you've placed the RVZ file and click on Select Folder. If done correctly, the game should appear in the big white box. Right click on the game, then go to Convert File. In Format, make sure ISO is chosen, then just click on Convert. The converting process will take a while, but you will be able to use the converted game files even in Dolphin 3.0. Interesting side note, all the converted ISO files will have the exact same file size of 4.37GB, regardless of game size. That's weird.
last chance.